me? So what can we do to engage all these our jobless, unemployed, unemployable citizens of our country? I started wearing this outfit since the beginning of this series. And you think, I just want to show you that I have a brother. Do you know the woman who sewed this for me? She graduated from University of Ibadan. Started this business several years ago. And I kept on patronizing her. Her husband stepped into politics and became two-term governor of Ogun State. She kept on her business. She's still doing the business. This is one of her outfits. It's from my Ye Ye Olufunke Daniel. A graduate that followed a passion to start making this. How much do you think she charges? Eat your certificate. You understand? Ebiapa, keep on seeking job. You are work, but where are you? And get up. What did you study at the University of Ife? Huh? Architecture. What do you do now? Asha okay. Huh? At and they are patronizing you. A kilo architecture could have money. It's a den do. Yamio get them there. She was preparing her lunch. She studied pharmacy at the University of Ife, uh, Ibano. Sorry. She cooks delicious meals. That was her passion from childhood. That's where her money is coming from now, not from pharmacy. What they call the Jewish phenomenon is that with your certificate, you must learn another trade because you can be dispersed at any time and be taken to diaspora where your certificate will not work or get you anything. But what you have learned, like Paul, who was a lawyer, who said this, my hands are provided for my necessities. He was no longer going to court. He was a tent maker. He said, this, my hands are provided for my necessities. Every one of you still looking for a job, you're a compound fool. Who is going to make that job for you? We are growing at the rate of 6 million per year. Where are you going to get 6 million jobs? The, the future does not belong to job seekers. It belongs to job creators. It belongs to entrepreneurs. It belongs to the like of my mother who did not go to school. They made a direct clothes in such a way that he catapulted into America to go teach in Bloomington, Indiana University, how Africans made their clothes before the Europeans came. Do you know Biela Segway went to university? Now my daughters, my wife, they patronize her. Another are patronizing them. Do you know Sovietica? They went to school. Some of the artists had won. It's by Sovietica. Do you know the man called Maste Dollar? He's the one sewing for all those in the House of Assembly. So for the governor. And he's sewing for me too. His factory is at Idiaraba. All he does there is to Agbada. If you go to him today and say, I need this Agbada in two days, he will get it ready for you without fail. And they are patronizing him home and abroad. He's shipping them abroad. What do you know how to do, rebel? To do, rebel? Who bury your talents and carry your certificate with the nickname of applicant. Applicant, my foot. The problem is created by you because you are depriving others of the talent you carry that could create jobs for more, more people. Government cannot keep on employing people. That's not their job. In fact, the civil service should be slashed. We have an overbloated government. It should be slashed and let us empower our citizens, introduce them to what they call Jewish phenomenon so that everyone has a trade. Do you know everyone called by Jesus was either a fisherman or a task? They had something to do. Joseph said to his brothers when they arrived in, the, in Egypt, he said, I'm taking, he said, I'm taking you before Pharaoh tomorrow and Pharaoh will only ask you one question, not what is your certificate? 
What diploma did you receive? He will ask you, what is your occupation? Lazy man that comes to church, and when you are going home, you are asking for money for transportation. What can you do with your hands? I can provide for your family. 